Hey guys, it's me, Life Simmer, and welcome to The Sims Pet Stories Let's Play. So, a few months back, I did The Sims Life Stories, and everybody loved that, almost everybody anyways. Um, people really liked it, and I decided we would go ahead and do the next installment of the series, The Sims Pet Stories. Um, so basically, this is the pet's turn on The Sims Stories, Life Stories, so um... Here we are in Abor Falls. This is the free play mode. Basically, Abor Falls is a pleasant resort style town nestled in the mountains of Sim City. The homes are modest, one to two story houses, usually surrounded by hills, trees, and businesses. A fun loving town, Abor Falls has become the lo bleh, location of choice for go getters and trendsetters everywhere. So, yeah, this is Abor Falls. You have some little families, Staten family, and Theodore family, hmm, the Clayton family, and of course, if you open up right here, you have a crap load of them, um, but yeah, this is a Boar Falls, holy crap, this is running real fast, um, and I'm going to go ahead and show you the first story of the Sims pet stories, it's called Best in Show. Alice Witt has inherited her grandparents' house. Recently, she moved back to Garden Heights to take ownership of the property, but mo money problems have put her on the verge of financial ruin. A starving artist, she has be hasn't been able to make ends meet every month, but she is determined to make a better life for herself and her dog, Sam. She may be forced to move if she doesn't come up with the simoleons to pay her taxes. Her friends, Amia and Thomas, are there to help, but ultimately, Alice must find a way to save her house. Also, excuse my voice, I'm sick right now. So this is the first story. Basically, you have to complete this story to unlock this one, Midnight Masquerade. And this is Stefan. Stefan. Stefan Loyal is an incredible, is an accomplished Sim City chef who leads a quiet and ordered life in the desert suburb of Mesa Flats. Lately, he's been unusually getting busy. Let's reread this, shall we? <laughs> uh, Steve. Stefan Loyal is an accomplished Sim City chef who leads a quiet and ordered life in the desert suburb of Meza Flats. Lately, he's been unusually busy getting ready for his cousin's wedding and helping his employer, Julianne, cater the annual Meza Flats Midnight Masquerade Ball. Little does Stefan know, I can't say his name, Stefan, 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 knows that his life is about to get turned upside down. Whatever, we'll learn your name by the time we come to you okay so let's go ahead and enter best in shows um i'm very excited to do this let's play it's the sims life stories was amazing so i imagine the sims pet stories will be amazing as well so the wit family Ma. <laughs> Pretty house. I like it. Oh, and this is my first time ever playing this, by the way. She's painting because it said she was an artist. Hmm. Oh, she's pretty. There's Sam. <laughs> Get it, Sam. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. And we are in gameplay mode. That was kind of neat. Welcome to the best of show. Here are a few tips before you begin. I already know all these. Um, so let's go ahead and venture around. It says, good morning to you, Sam. You want some love? Sam is always waiting beside my bed for me in the morning. I should show him how much I appreciate him with some affection. So we will rub his belly. <laughs> He's cute. Awesome. Time to get dressed. I should look in my bedroom dresser and change my outfit. Okay, she's gonna go change into... I guess she'll plan her everyday wear. See what she has. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, I'm just gonna keep her in this because it works. First, let's change her into her gym clothes. There we go. Time to change your clothes. Um, 
much better. Now that I'm dressed, I should change my look a little bit. I've got to stay fashionable. A quick look in the bathroom mirror should help me sort out my appearance. So we're going to change her appearance real fast. Just because, I don't know, makes them have characteristics, I guess, that I wouldn't choose usually. So yeah, I'm just going to keep her how she is. She's fine. But here's some of the masks that uh, we will be using in the next story, which is kind of exciting. Try, trying a new look is a lot of fun. Anytime I want to spice up my appearance, I know I can do it quickly and for free. Hungry Sam, want me to fill up your bowl? Okay, so I guess we're kind of just saddling in. This is Sam. He's really cute. Look how cute he is. He's a Dalmatian. <laughs> we'll have her use the restroom. And uh, get some food. She'll have some chips. Oh, hell nah, boy. We are not going to do this. <laughs> Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get it. Sam just chewed on your Sims furniture. Boo. Scold them. Sorry, Sam, but that's n no, no. This dog is going to destroy my house. I really need to train him so that he doesn't continue to eat out my house. Oh, Sam, what am I going to do with you? I know what you're gonna do. You're gonna clean that up. <laughs> Oh, or not. I know. What is... Why did she do that? Anyways, I know. Maybe if I teach Sam a new trick, he'll learn a little discipline. He needs to learn how to come here. So I guess first we'll teach him how to come here and then we'll clean up. Great. Awesome. And there's some people here. Oh. He's barking. Who is this? Who is this lady with the bun on her head? Now who is this lady? I should greet her and see what she wants. Alright, greet Diana. Diana de Brock. De Boer. De Boer, not de Brock. De Boer. Oh, and for the new people, I this is a brand new mic and we're still getting used to it. We don't know if we like it or not yet, so that's why it might sound weird. <laughs> Anywho, though, let's go ahead and meet this chick. Can I help you? No, dear. We are here to see how much work this house will need. Once I undoubtedly own it. <laughs> Haven't you heard? You owe the bank 120,000 smolians, and I have purchased the deed in case you can't pay. I doubt you will be able to pay the full amount, so I will be the new owner. Uh, excuse me, but who exactly are you? <laughs> Really, dear, don't be slow. I am Deanna de Boer. <laughs> I will soon be the new owner of this decrepit no hovel. My men just need to look around, and we will soon be off thereafter. Get it, Alice. Tell her. Listen, Deanna. I am not planning on losing the house my grandfather built with his bare hands. I am going to pay this step and you will just have to find another house to level. What a little rude bitch. Who are you? Get it, Alice. Yeah. Oh, oh no. I've had enough of this Deboer woman. She needs to leave immediately. Oh, I didn't even do that. What the hell? Oh. oh my goodness. Alice. Alice. Good. Kicked her ass, too. Alright, we're gonna ask her to leave. She needs to go. Don't wave at me. Lady, it just so happens that I am pretty resourceful and I am going to get... Going to find a way to pay off this step. Now, if you don't mind, I would like you to leave. I'm not going anywhere, you detergent. Degenerate? I, I'm sorry, guys. I suck. I suck. This property is practically mine. Why don't you and your filthy mongrel start packing up your things? Oh, you mess with Sam. You're messing with the wrong woman. 
Hi, <laughs> Hi, random chick. Oh, you're cute. Okay. Anywho. I think it's time to show her I mean business. I am not going to give her... I'm going to give her a good poke. Alright. You just fought her, so now you're going to go poke her. Okay. Oh, good. We did not... She did that. Can we... Can we not? Oh, we lost that time. It's not good. Okay. Miss Debor, you don't scare me. I won't let you take this house. Maybe an eviction notice on the front door will shack some scare up to you. Dairy. How about you just leave? You see, young lady, I don't get... I don't care about this house. I just want the land. And whatever I get, whatever I want, I get. I'm sorry, guys. I really can't read today. Good day, madam. I said good day. Good, leave. Nobody wants you here. Like, honestly, you weren't even invited inside, you little rude. Won't even say the word. And you, Blake Brock. Brock, that's your name, Brock Thornton. Who are you? Get out. Goodbye. Thanks. Okay. Where's the other man? Oh, hold on. Who is this? We ha we saw Brock. And this guy with a ponytail and a mustache. And a beard. Get it. Alright, walk it out. Leave and never come back. Okay? Thank you. Hmm. Alright, Alice. What are we gonna do? I'm so sick. <laughs> Alright, so I guess- Oh, that looks good. I'm so hungry right now. You know when people get sick, they're like, I can't eat. That's not me. I can eat whenever you give me food. Oh, eat your food. Stop crying. Me time. I've been really busy. I should use this time to take care of myself, explore other interests, and generally do things that make me happy. So, I know she likes to paint, so we'll continue painting. Look at this little sign in our uh, house. Like, how about you just leave, like, for real? Just go away. So, we'll just paint for a little while. Oh, the delivery man's here. Delivery for Miss Wit. Hi. Yes, yell in his face. Okay, we received a pet bed for Sam. Awesome. We'll put it in the bedroom. Great. Yeah, we already took it out. Wait, now I have two because I did that. Oh my god. Oops. Oh, it's the dog bed I ordered last week. I wish I could return this for 120,000 simoleons. Well, you can't, bruh. <laughs> Today, I met the lady named Diana DeBoer. I guess she owns the whole town or something. She says she'll own my house unless I can come up with 120,000 simoleons. Where am I supposed to get that money that fast? So, right here, you'll just have some pictures. Of what happened this chapter and yeah it's pretty neat uh, so it's only 6 p.m. and we're doing absolutely nothing woohoo oh cool she finished her painting go ahead and sell it for 500 simoleons holy crap all right start painting another one <laughs> she's actually really good what's her skill oh all the way all ten of them Hmm, neat. What's Sam doing? Rolling in our flowers, you little bastard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you can't control pets in The Sims 2. This is a series based off The Sims 2, so you can't control them like The Sims 3. Hmm. Alright, we're just going to fast forward through this. Oh, she's painting one that's really, really pretty. I can just tell it's pretty. Alrighty, so we're going to send her to bed, actually. Um, 
I'm gonna go ahead and skip until she wakes up, and I will see you guys then. Okay, and De Deanna, why did why did I say that? Oh my gosh, Alice is awake. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's gonna go use the restroom and then take a nice bath and uh, have herself some cereal for breakfast. You do have these shortcut keys if you see right here next to your things, where you can just press the button um, and it will do it for you. It will do the command instead of you clicking on stuff. Um, but we're going to go ahead and uh, oh, say I made a mess. So go ahead and clean that up. How about that? Sam. Sam. And we're going to scold him. Or her. What is Sam? I'm pretty sure it's a boy. Sam can go both ways. Sam can go both ways. Um, where can I check this? I'm guessing Sam's a boy. So we're just going to say Sam's a boy. Um, but no. Sam needs to be scolded for just being bad, I guess. Uh, but we still have one more pile, some dirty pancakes or wasted pancakes, and um, a bag of chips. And we need to fill up Sam's food bowl. There we go. Chapter 2. Hope Springs Eternal. Okay, Sam. Maybe we should take a walk and get out of the house for a bit. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and take Sam on a walk. So, yep, they're off. On a little walk. Fast forward through this. And they're back. Awesome. The newspaper. Hey, the newspaper has been delivered. Maybe I can find some ideas on what to do next in there. Fine. Oh, no, don't find a job. I mean, you should find a job, but I guess we won't. Maybe read it? Hey, I think I found something, Sam. If we enter the dog show competition and we win, we can pay off the bills for this place. Gee, thanks for the enthusiasm, pal. Okay, so... I guess we're gonna do something. Let's register at Playground for Precious, Sam. Okay, so we're gonna go to Playground for Precious. Alright, we're gonna take multiple Sims. Stop cooking, Alice. You're about to leave. And we're gonna go to Playground for Precious. And I guess register to be in dog shows, cause best in show, I mean, hello. <laughs> Playground for Precious. Here we are. Pretty neat. There's a sign-up table over there on the table. Awesome. So, right over here. Come on, Sam. Let's go register. So, if we come over here, we can go ahead and just register. I hope... Oh, it says, before you register, we must verify that your dog can compete a basic run-through at the A-frame here. We can't let every mutt register for the event, you know. I hope you're up to a little training session, Sam. Let's try to get you through this and so the official will register us. Okay, so we got to train Sam on here. Um, he's supposed to run over it. Hopefully he does. Come on, Sam. Come on, Sam. <laughs> Your dog will have to do better than that for this show. I'm sorry, but we cannot allow. They're whispering, I guess. <laughs> I'm sorry, Miss Wit. There's been sort of, um... A misunderstanding. Please come forward and register. Okay, that was weird. Let's finish registering, Sam. So we're gonna go register. This reminds me of registering for school. Awesome. How about we go chat with the other contestants? Maybe some of their wisdom can rub off on us. So there's three of them. So we'll go talk to this guy up here first. 
Coach Grindler. Grinder? Grinder. Ugh. So I guess we'll go chat with him real fast. <laughs> Permission to speak denied, civilian. You can't psych us out. Show her your war face, meat. His dog's name is Meat. Okay. Um, here's Henry Biz Bizniz. Something like that. We're going to go chat with him. Don't look at him in the eye. He'll take it as a challenge. You don't want to challenge him. He's a champion. And Melissa Carter. Please don't interrupt us. We're channeling our chai for competition. Okay. I think we've learned all that we can learn from these guys. Let's go home, Sam. Alrighty, so they're going to go ahead and... Uh, Call the taxi. She says, your energy is seriously impairing our, our winning vibe. Okay, well, you're weird. Like, who does that? So, we're going to go home. And, um, I guess we'll be seeing these competitors a lot because these are the people we will be competing with. But, um, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here because it's around 20 minutes. I'm sorry that I've been sick. There's nothing really I can do about it. I just really wanted to get this video up. Um, but this Let's Play seems like it's going to be a lot of fun. I can't wait to get into it. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, so I will see you guys in the next part. Bye, guys.